today I will be making an AVR ISP header for these connectors. They are 6x2 connectors and they are basically impossible to plug into breadboards because of their spacing. So you are going to need three of these four pin mail header pieces. I broke them off from a longer breakaway header. And the first thing you're going to do is you're going to move these edge pins down. So let's see if I can move. You can either use pliers or you can put them on the edge of a desk like this and push. And they both have the same effect. Next, you want to bend these ends out like so. So, I'm gonna grab your pliers again, I'm gonna grab this edge and here, and just bend it in. And there's one end bent. And And there's the other. Now, to get into the final shape you need, you're going to want to push the spin back up. So, I'm going to start that out on the table. And then just send it all the way up to the end. Now that should fit into the breadboard, and you need three of them. So, there you go. And now, after soldering, okay, so I soldered the connectors back on all of them. So, now I have three sets of do buy one connectors and I have this piece of paper and uh, CA glue and accelerator but normal super glue will also work so I am going to take a small strip from my paper Place it on the breadboard. Needs to be thinner. It needs to be thin enough to lie between the two legs. And it needs to be as snug as possible. So I'm going to take these, place them, making sure that they are all flat and level. And then I'm going to use the connector that came with this to make sure it fits well. That's good. So now I can move this. Now the breadboard will hold these together in line and level. So I need to get my cyanacrylate glue. What I'm also going to do is I'm also going to Cut small notches in some paper and place them on the outside. With skin tape, possibly. So, masking tape might be an easy option. As can take some small pieces and place them on the edges to keep my breadboard from getting stuck to the pins. And now all I need to do is apply a small amount
one half there. Let that flow together. And then it would accelerate. And that should set really quickly. Now, I can just hit it again. As you can see, it's setting. I'm going to flip it over, clean off of it, and one drop on the other side as well. And after a few seconds of letting that set, cleaning up the workspace. We can put it back in, everything works. And now, if we compare it to my previous setup, as seen here, which is basically just a harness that leads into a bedboard, we can now take this header. Plug it in and then just plug one of these. 